so this first boy girl scene that you did, like, how did that come about? Where, and where were you? So I had a sugar daddy here okay. in California mm-hmm. and his next door neighbor, which I forget who he was, but he used to be an adult. So okay. I was talking to him about it. And he, I was like, so how do I go about it? Because I don't want to get myself, you know, like there's people that shoot porn, but they're, it's not really porn. They're, yeah. you know, shoot, I don't know. You like show up. stuff. Yeah. I didn't want to. You show up to like a hotel room and it's like one guy and like a camera on a tripod and you're right. like, what, you know what I mean? Yeah, that's like, and then it's I'm like gonna, not a real production. No. Yeah. So I wanted to do it correctly. He told me that I should get an agent mm-hmm. and then. They'll make sure, you know, everyone's tested, everyone's safe, these are, you know, yes. companies shoot for all this stuff. So yes. I applied to a couple agencies. I went with HTMLA mm-hmm. and then they flew me out because I was still in Ohio. And well, I was here and then I went back to Ohio because that's where I'm from. Mm-hmm. So he was like, when do you want to come out? And I said, whenever. So he flew me out the next day. Yeah. Oh, and I dude, shot. I bet he did. He saw you. Yeah. I mean, because you're really fucking cute. And so. I get a lot of submissions of girls that want to be in all the time. And if someone like you sent me your photos, I'd be like, yeah, fuck yeah. So, like, yeah, yeah. of course he flew you out the next day. They called me because I applied online. So they called me. I was walking my dog. They called me when I was still on my walk with my dog. Yeah. And he's the only agency that took me. Interesting. Did the yeah. rest of them reject you or they just didn't call yeah. you? What What was their they reason? They didn't call me or they rejected me I because I have really small boobs, so they thought that I should get breast implants. What? Isn't that insane? That's insane. so many people are like, don't get... I've learned now that, you know, it's very 50-50 what people like, yeah. so I was very surprised. That's insane because also, too, like you like being young and looking young, I would think that... I would imagine that I could last you, for a while. Yeah, you probably do a yeah. lot of like the quote unquote teen stuff, right? Yeah. yeah, if you got breast implants, you wouldn't be able to do that. So no. like well, that's totally insane that anyone would give you that advice. And then what I would be shooting MILF cuz then MILF wouldn't really No. I would be in that awkward stage. Yeah, because already. now all is categorized by you're either a teen or you're or a, a MILF. MILF. There's like yeah. no in between. Yeah. I mean, there's a couple hot wife, you know, type of stuff, yeah. but I have friends that are 20 something and you know they have breast implants and all this stuff and they're shooting MILF. So oh, I didn't want to really like I shot do that. a scene um a couple of weeks ago where the teen was 23 and the MILF was 26. There was 3 years age yeah. difference between them. Yeah. And I was like this is fucking ridiculous. Or the best is when it's like a a MILF and a a, a son or you know whatever yeah. they're playing younger yeah. guy and the guy is, you know, older. Older than the actual yeah, girl. These, yeah, because some of these guys are like, you know, like Tyler Nixon, he's 30. But he but looks he young. he looks like 18, yeah. 20, yeah. you know, so. And then some of these girls are like 25, 26, but then they get, you know what it is? It makes you look older. It's like number Botox. one. Botox. The lip injections. Oh, That yeah. is 100% makes you yeah. look older. Like almost, I mean, I know a couple girls that have gotten them where it's, you haven't really like, it's not that noticeable and it doesn't make you look older, but mm-hmm. a lot of these girls overdo it. And that like always makes you look older. Always. Have you kissed someone with lip injections? Like a lot. No. Cause they're very hard. Really? Well, first like- of all, um, I will say I'm like totally straight. So uh, I've like, I never kissed know. girls. <laughs> oh, you never kissed a girl? Oh, yeah. I mean, I have. Oh. I had sex with, well, I had sex with two women. And a threesome or just... Um, both were threesome. Well, one was a hooker. that doesn't count. In Amsterdam. So I don't think that we kissed because she wasn't into that. Oh. You know what I mean? <laughs> I forgot that's how it goes. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, and then the second one was actually a friend of a friend and we were at a Halloween party and I was super drunk. So we started making out and then like she, and then it ended up being a threesome. Like she dragged her boyfriend in and I was like, oh, I like wasn't really into her boyfriend, but I was like, fine. Oh. I felt bad. So I like sucked his because I was like, oh, you fine. You felt bad Because I felt bad for him. Isn't but, that the worst when you feel bad for the, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good segue into our next story. Yeah, right. <laughs> but um, yeah, so I have never kissed anybody with lip injections because back when I did make out with, I guess, only one girl, 
Um, it wasn't really popular because this was a long time ago. And then I've only ever kissed guys, and I have never kissed a guy with lip injections. I would hope not. Be weird. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Hey guys, if you want to support my show, then you should think about joining my Patreon. At my Patreon, I offer all kinds of amazing perks in exchange for your financial support. From live streams of my interviews as they are happening, to bonus Q&As, behind the scenes photos and videos of my shoots, plus cool merch like stickers, mugs, and hoodies, we have you covered. So go to patreon.com slash hollyrandallunfiltered, and while you're at it, make sure that you click that subscribe button so you don't miss a single one of my new updates.